Good afternoon, everyone. Jason here. Today is Monday, February 29th, and this is your aftermarket update. So it was a good day, ended up being a good day here uh, in the live call uh, day trading chat room, uh, but it was not without its challenges. In fact, uh, early in the session, uh, I was having quite a bit of difficulty uh, getting my sea legs underneath me, if you will, on the ES, but that quickly changed uh, when we, t and I say quickly, quickly is a relative term. Uh, there was a long uh, trade that we took here on the ES that actually carried us all the way into about 1.30 p.m. Central Time today. And let's take a look at that particular trade. So this morning, uh, I had a couple of trades off the daily structure signal, first time touch off of this level. I was up just a little bit. Uh, and then we came down into the revision signal and my expectation level was we were going to come deeper. Uh, actually, we did come deeper, but it took way later in the day for us to do it. So as we were moving around into this area, um, I ended up taking a couple of stop outs here on the ES before getting short right up here against the market structure mid at 1955 quarter. What I want you to see here is the time of day uh, that this is. This is at 1045, 1040 this a.m. Central Time uh, when this uh, market structure mid uh, actually triggered. Uh, it wasn't until 1.30 p.m. in the afternoon, so about three hours we were sitting in this trade here today uh, waiting for us to hit the target. So I'm going to show you the uh, 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 an abridged version. In fact, I'm going to show you just the last 20 minutes. In fact, there is a really nice uh, oil trade, and I'll talk about that in just a few moments, as well as uh, this ES trade that uh, where the video picks up on this ES trade, I think we are eight and a half points positive, not ticks, uh, but points positive when we pick up the video here uh, on the ES. But let's just turn off. I'm going to turn off the revision signals just to clean this chart up for a minute. In fact, I'm going to turn the structure signals off as well, just so you can see that the market came right up into uh, the market structure mid here at 1955 quarter. It rallied to 1956 quarter and then began this long uh, move to the downside. Now I'm going to turn back on, uh, I'm going to turn back on the daily structure uh, signal and in, in, uh, indicators as well. So the signals, the mid and the uh, targets uh, indicators as well here on your market maker levels. And so that the way that these market maker levels work is once you achieve a target like you did up here, the daily structure target, we went just beyond that to the market structure mid where I looked to get short. The expectation level, and we talked about this in the room, was that it was going to come back, that there was a really good possibility that it comes back to 1929.75. So once it hits the daily structure target, it's just the way that these market maker levels perform. The expectation level is that you get down to the daily structure signal. So what we were doing is we were trying to ride this market down as far as we could. So you came in here, daily structure, uh, market structure mid at 55 quarter. Uh, we came down here to uh, 51 half and we just went back and forth here uh, for quite some time. So as the market continues to, to, to gyrate up and down and we just continue to plod through the day, you could see that the market... Uh, begins to pick up steam right around the one o'clock time frame. So we came down, uh, rotated quite a bit, and right here there is a revision uh, mid, which is right here. So you can see how we have this revision signal. Uh, but I'm going to turn these off because they don't play as big a factor here when you're looking to go from structure target down to structure signal on the other side. Anyway, the market continues to roll, and about 1.30, which is right here, uh, is where I end up getting taken out. I think I got, uh, I think I ended up getting 13 points out of this move here. Uh, the market, though, does eventually come all the way down at the end of the day, right around 3 o'clock Central Time to the daily structure signal. So we talked about this. If you were in the uh, chat room today, you know that we talked about getting all the way down to that daily structure signal. Uh, we did catch uh, a very nice ride. I think I took uh, two off at uh, two points, I took one off at 12 points, and then I took the other one off at like uh, 13 or 14 points. But I'll let you watch the last 20 minutes so you can see where that final lot came off. But as the market comes all the way down into the daily structure signal, that's where we ended the day. And so again, market maker levels uh, performing as advertised, and uh, they are very, very good on the ES. Again, if you don't know the history of these levels, 
they were taught to me by a floor trader, 30-year veteran floor trader who traded on the S&P pits and the uh, then adapted these levels to the screen uh, trading. And so that's what we use in here to trade the ES. So we've picked up back up on the ES again. It's been a very nice uh, four days here uh, at the oil trading group. Um, we've had a very nice four day run here since uh, middle of last week. And uh, again, another day where the market maker levels uh, did very, very well. Let's talk about the CL here just really quickly. Uh, we were in a long CL trade here today. Uh, we were short right around this 83, 84 area. Market rotates around back and forth, comes back up. Took me out once or twice for break even. Uh, eventually coming back down and taking out this 22 level. So what you're going to see on the last half of this video is I'm on a two lot from 84 short. Uh, it comes right down into 34. Uh, you can't really see it on this 15 minute chart, but it comes down into 34, rallies back up to 44, takes me out at break even plus 40 on two lots, and then comes on down to 22 before rallying again. Uh, to end the day. So this is going to be the CL trade. It's right up against your OTG support and resistance level right here around this 84 level. The market comes down again, gives us a nice profit at the very end of the trading day, and then continues to rally where it is now just past the open. So again, uh, I'm not going to take a lot of your time here. This about I'm going to let you watch the last 20 minutes of both this ES trade and this CL trade. Uh, the ES trade is about eight and a half points when you pick it up, and we're about 15 or 20 points positive on the CL trade. But you'll get to see both of these trades uh, go to their completion. So without further ado, here is the OTG ES and CL trade of the day. There's 46.75. Get through it. Come on, both markets need to push through here. You've got liquidity at 46.5 all the way down, really, to that final target underneath this. There's 46.75. You're now 8.5 points. There's 40, There's 66.65. Let's see if we can't get the CL to get on down through it here. Tell you what I'm going to do. Yeah, I'm going to leave it at 34 for now, but we may look to tighten that up quite a bit here. There's 46 quarter on the ES. That's nine points on the ES. We're looking for 43 quarter. There's 46. That's the top of the daily structure signal here. We may bounce. So let's bring it to 40, 48 quarter here on the stop. You are nine points right here at 46 quarter. 46. I'm looking to get to 43 quarter. There's 63, 62. There's 49, there's 45 half on the ES. Okay, so we're looking to get to 43 quarter, come down into settlement, 43 quarter. Okay, there's 45, bring it down another four points, ticks, to 47 quarter on the trail stop. Okay, hopefully you stayed in. May come back on this though. I may bring this back. 43 quarter is the target here. We're at 58, 57 here on the CL. There's 10 points on your ES. We're just a couple of points away from bringing this thing home. Go ahead and protect here to 74 on the trail stop on the CL. Forty-five quarter, ten points. Come on, keep pushing. There's fifty, sixty, fifty-nine. There's ten points on the ES. We've got some liquidity right here. Got to push through it. Been down as deep as forty-five zero zero. There's fifty-seven, fifty-six. Come on, you've got one sixteen long at fifty right now. One sixteen long at fifty. One sixteen long at fifty. See if we can't push through that. There's 45 quarter. We've got a little bit of an iceberg order going on there. Let's bring this trail stop down to 69 on the CL. 69 on the CL. There's 45 quarter. We got to get through the bottom here at 45.00. Zero, zero. Come on, push through it. 
55, come on, 54, 53, muscle your way through this level here. 45 quarter, 45, come on, get your way through that 45. There's 57, 56, got to get through 45, 0, 0. Got to get through 45 quarter, then 45. There's 45. Come on. Get through that 45. 43 quarter is the target here on the ES. 60, 74, 69. 69 is the trail stop on the CL. There's 45, 44, 75. Bring this down to 46 quarter on the trail stop. There's 44 half, 46 quarter on the trail stop. There's 44 half. We are close, my friends. We are close. There's 44 quarter. There's 11 points. One more point, point and a half here now on the ES. 46 quarter is the stop here. 46 quarter is the stop. 113 limit orders long at 50. Okay, you've got right into the top of the box here you've got market structure signal so we've got we're just trying to push down into this revision signal down here we got to get through here one last little push we got to get through 5150 as well on the cl 53 come on break it right here break down through it here Come on, down through it here. Down through it. Got to get through. Down through it here. There's 57, 56 on the CL. Come on. One last little push to the downside here. Okay, I'm going to get just a little higher to 47 quarter on this ES. And the reason for that is... We may come back into the structure signal and test the underside of that before we go. And I think we're going to come down into that 50 area down there on the CL. Okay, there's 44 half. We've been as deep as 44 half. We've got to get through 44 quarter. Forty-four seventy-five, forty-six seventy-five on the trail stop. Come on, CL. Bring the trail stop on the CL back to seventy-four. Fifty-nine, fifty-eight. Got to get through 44 half, then 44 quarter. There's 56. Bring it back to 69 on the CL. We got to get through 44 quarter here. Come on. Don't stall. Get through both of these levels. Let's get both of these to push down through it here. A little bit of liquidity at 44 even. Market structure signal here again. There's 44 half. Come on, 44 quarter. Lots, they got an iceberg order at 44 half right here. There's 44. We got to get through 50 and then 44. There's 54, 53. Come on, there's 44 half. Now go. All right, first target. Hey, that 40, you got that target, baby. You got that big target, 12 points. Big 12 point target. Okay, so now the stop is 47 quarter on one. Got that big 12 point target. Okay. How's that for badass? Excuse me. There's 50, 49, 50. Let's go get through that 50 now. Still got one left. Looking to target the CL down there at 34. Looking to target that CL down there at 34. Bring this trail stop now to 64. 
bring that trail stop down to 64. We got to get through 50, 49, and then deeper. There's 50. You got an iceberg order coming in at 50 here. Okay, so your next target underneath you is deep. Like it's somewhere between 1933.75 and 1930. It's deep. So after a tricky start today, I am in the black in a nice big way. So that's good, right? That's, they don't ask how you start. It's just how do you finish? So, 15 minutes here. 15 minutes to the bottom of the hour. My trail stop right now in the CL is at 64. What am I in from? 84, 20 ticks. I think we're going to take this target out into the close. I think we're going to take this target out into the close. Thirty-four down there is the target. I'm gonna look to take them both off at thirty-four. I'm gonna bring the trail stop back to sixty-nine, and that's the last time I'm messing with it. So I got one lot left on the ES. It's not a lot, but it's my lot. Ha. Yeah, and at least it's not an empty lot. Exactly. All right, so patience. We're still in it. All right, Bob, we'll see you, buddy. Have a good one. 12 minutes to the bottom of the hour. I need to be bailing out here soon as well, just because I've been sitting here since about 4 o'clock this morning. Stop here. Seventy four. Trying to stay in it. Come on, 55, 54. Come on, get through it. Okay, you're at 42.75. You're still rolling here on the, on the ES. Look at the, both of these markets roll out of it here. Come on, 53, 52. Looking to get down to 34. I'm going to take two off at 34. We got to get through 50. Bring the trail stop on the ES to 45 quarter. Here comes 51.50.
We've got uh, 111 long at 40 right now. 111 long at 40. And we're still looking to target. We're going to start protecting quite a bit more on the ES here. But the anticipation and expectation, actually, is that we reach out. There's 47, 46. We've got to get through 45. First target again is our target down there is 34. We may only get to 38. I'm going to bring the trail stop here to 59 on the uh, 64 on the CL. 64 on the CL. Looking to get down to 34 down there. There's You're now 13 and a half points positive on the ES. And we're going to protect down to 44 quarter here. Down to 44 quarter on the ES. Anybody still hanging on to one? There's 43, 42. Looking to get to 34. There's 42, 41. Trail stop now is at 54. 30 ticks on the CL. There's 42, 41. 40, 39. Let's go ahead and protect here. There's 36, 35. Go ahead and protect here to 44. Protecting to 44. We just got down to 37, 36. Did we miss me by a tick? Or did we hit it? We did hit it and I didn't fill. We hit 7 at 34. It didn't fill me. ES is rolling out of bed here. Stop is at 44 now. Stop is at 44 on the CL. Stop is at 44. I can't believe we hit it and didn't fill it. Stop is at 10 ticks away at 44 from the from the hit down there. There's 42, 41, 42, 43, and I'm out at 44. So that's done. That's a big day there. Not bad, right? Came all the way down to that 34. It hit me and didn't fill me. Okay, so now you've got uh, 14 and a quarter points on the ES. Now you got 14 and a quarter points on the ES. So now what we're doing is we're bringing it down to 140, 1943 quarter. 1943 quarter, looking to target 1930 on the ES. And I think this is going to take out that target down there at 34, I do believe. I do believe. But this is cool, right? We're good. It's all good. We're in good shape, guys. We're in good shape. All right, so 34 was the target, and we hit it to the tick. I think it's going to continue down. I think it's going to continue down. I'm probably going to take at 1934, although I do think we'll hit the structure signal here. We can do this now. Hang on a second here. All right, so we're going to we're just putting this uh, ES trade on the chart here or up on the board here for a second. And talk about what we're looking for. We got daily structure mid down here at uh, 37.75. So you're 14 points on the ES here. Turn these revisions back on. We're underneath the revision signal. We could come down to revision target here as well in 1936 quarter. And there's your there's your target. I could have held on for an extra 10 ticks there, dadgummit. Oh, well, I'm not complaining. Trust me. You're not hearing me complain. This turned out to be a really nice day after a tough start to it. About five minutes till the bottom of the hour here. About five minutes till the bottom of the hour. Yeah, and that's what I thought would happen. What's happening now on the CL is kind of where my head was. Hopefully, maybe you held on for the target a little deeper. I didn't, obviously, but you got it. All right, you got it. 
So I told you both these markets could head to their center point, and 32.92 is kind of that area that you'd be watching for. That would not be surprising to me. Now remember, 64 is was the day's high to low 70.5. I don't think we're going to get there. In fact, I don't even, you know, we got a breakthrough 1940 quarter here. You are 14, 15 points now on the ES, and it's continuing to roll. Let's protect another point to 1942 quarter. Nice, Lawrence. That's awesome, dude. I'm at, uh, after everything, commissions included, I'm at, right now as we sit here, I'm up 150 ticks-ish. <coughs> Sorry, 115, not 150, 115. But we'll give a little bit back if we come back to 42 quarter. So, Philippe, are you still in this ES? It's now 15 and a quarter points, yes. You closed it? Okay. I'm hanging on for your market maker levels down below your daily structure signal, 1933. But it could retrace, and I'm going to get out at 1942. If I get out at 1942, my entry was 1955. That'd be 13 points. 1942 quarters, 13 points. <laughs> That's okay, Philippe. I get it. I understand. So we got down to 1939.75. Previous session low on that ES is right here at 1941 quarter. And so if we could close below that previous session low here, that's going to be pretty good at the risk of being obvious. out of my ES trade.